there, Liana. Did you feel any kind of way about that? After she got there, yeah. And then kind of maybe when I first in, like introduced the idea, because I don't know, he 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 kind of tried to stop her from coming at first on some shit. Because that's this the time when um, a lot of people know um, Mojo. I mean, Mojo and Flo is about to come. He's like, y'all got my secret weapons about to come. And he's like, Mojo and Flo coming because that's when Zelda was there. The other Flo was there. Um, and he was always hyped up about them coming. This is the same time EJ was coming too. And he was like, man, okay. I'm be ready, bro. Da, 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 da. He always used to say that. But I, I ain't really suspect nothing until one night, you know, on Surreal, one night I woke up, she wasn't in the tent, and I heard them in there talking. And I'm like, what the fuck? Like, how the fuck you sneak out of the tent? You know what I'm saying? I ain't even noticed, goddamn. So I'm just playing cool. I'm listening. He's talking about <laughs> And I'm here, I'm just listening. She's like, yeah, you know, sometimes I feel like, oh, man, don't understand me, blah, 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 blah. And they're they talking. He's like, it was some more stuff. He's like, yo, one day, uh, something like that, we're going to have a meeting, just me and you. And I'm like, what the fuck? And then she coming back to the tent, so I'm acting like I'm asleep still. She, I just wanted to see what her, her first action was going to be, you know what I'm saying? She was going to lay down and try to act like she was asleep the whole time, you know what I'm saying? Or if she was gonna come to tell me like, yo, I just had a um a meeting with, you know what I'm saying? At the time they was coming who was calling a master teacher. I wanted to see right. if she was gonna tell me. So I'm sitting there, I'm laying down, you know what I'm saying? And she come back in the tent and don't say nothing. And I'm like, So what was y'all talking about? Da 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 And Azul always laughed at me to this day because Azul always heard the shit because his tent was right beside us and shit like that. <laughs> but um Talking about the shit, she was like, no, it ain't that serious, you know what I'm saying, da 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 basically pleading her case about what they was talking about and shit like that. But um, that's that's maybe when my antenna start going up. I also having a lot of dreams and shit. Like, a lot of the, the our days started off bad because my dreams would be like, I'm like, right. it would be them, you know what I'm saying, together. I'm like, and I would just wake up, I'm like, yo, I was like, you gonna leave me for this nigga, bro. Like you gonna leave me? She's like, "What are you talking about? It's just a father figure to me." Da 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 da. And long story short, down the road, I end up finding through finding out through a, a Instagram comment. Like on some real shit, I didn't even find out by them. I didn't even know what happened. Happened, you know what I'm saying? It's crazy how I found out because it was it was. It was presented in a way that it wasn't supposed to be, you know what I'm saying? Even <sighs> Yeah, because I could tell I mean, I could tell, listen, brother, I can tell like everybody else could tell how much that you loved her. I could see it through the photos. I looked through your Facebook page and I said, Wow. Like when I really start, you know, looking at melanation within itself and when it changed over to carbonation with everything that took place in Costa Rica. And I said, well, damn, Olmec, he really did love Eliana. Like, he really did love Velvet like that. So for all of this to transpire, you know, and for Master Chief, as he called himself, do what he did, what does that tell you now about this whole experience? I mean, like, like everything, if you could just sum it up. Like, what was the I mean, whole... I think that's what the, the, the voice is trying to tell me. It's like, you, I'm going to take you on this journey. Just observe, you know what I'm saying? Like, just observe. It ain't gonna be all peaches and cream, like all good. It's gonna be bad too, cause all of the times wasn't good. I mean, all of the times wasn't bad over there. Some of it was good, but when it was bad, it was bad. Real shit. Wow, that is that's bugged out. So, so Phoenix is Phoenix rising. Is he still over there? No, he's not over there anymore. Okay. No. Cause I seen a video where he was kind of radiated and he was saying that nature boy tried to make a pass at his direct. Were you there when that happened? Like when nature boy tried to holler at his wife? Um, I don't know, bro. Uh, you don't know? Um, I don't know. I mean, I know it's been a while. I know a lot done took place and all of that, man. I, I already know, you know, I know you on a whole different journey now, but I even seen photos of you with Yada. And that's why I was like, damn, you know, like, you know, you see a brother that's really actually living that life and trying to do something on a progressive level. You know, I could see why you could gravitate towards him. 
but I never could understand how that you could be dealing with nature, boy. That was the whole thing. I just was like, what, what, what is this? I didn't even see it in you. Yeah, I feel like that was just a part of my journey that I had to go through to realize that I would have never known the importance of nationality and what rights we would have. You know what I'm saying? If I would have never went through what I experienced, I went through in Costa Rica with the law, you know what I'm saying? Because nobody right. really treated me as a human, even though I was fucked up like that. Nobody was like, you good? Not, you know what I'm saying? You good? Nobody, nobody cared. And nobody, right. you know what I'm saying? Even though what led up to that, we probably deserved it, but it, I, I see the bigger picture of everything. Because the same laws that apply to us over there, I mean, over here in America, you see a black person, you can beat their ass. Black right. person, quote, unquote, you know what I'm saying? Same things apply over right there in Costa Rica. It's still the same land as this one continent that got colonized by the same people. They still under the same codes and statutes, bro. And we still be identifying ourselves as chattel property. That's the one thing. That's what I think it was. That message, if you go back and listen to that message, that's when the last realest message, I swear to God, that he said was that chattel property shit. But he didn't say why we chattel property. Why he didn't say why? How we classify, right. identified as black, African-American colored people. We're not claiming our ancestry, so nobody... You know what I'm saying? We not we don't have no descent nature. You're not even a part of the human family. You call yourself black. Black not even, you know what I'm saying? It's not even a noun that describe a person, place, a thing. It's an adjective. So if you are Correct. black, like what? And black don't even actually describe us. This is black. My 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 skin is not black. You see what I'm saying? And we got an ancestry. The most the fucking most royal ancestry ever. We don't want to embrace it the majority of us that call ourselves black colored people african americans don't even know about the prophet that came in 1928 told us that we're not black african american or colored people anymore we don't even know and, and when you brought us when you say that when you say that when you say that number because i'm from north carolina mm -hmm. i'm from north carolina i'm up on the five but this the seven right here